Hi guys and welcome to 60 over fashion once again. So this week as you can see I'm in a stylish smart mode getting ready for the spring outside adventures maybe a barbecue meet at a pub or whatever. Uh, I've worn this before crisp white shirt light blue jacket and some dark wash jeans and of course my trusted shoes. Now this is very smart, the jeans go great with this, you can use a couple of different colour trousers with this, you could go dark but not too light. This works great. Let's have a look see what uh, I've picked up in the last week and uh, one mistake and one goodbye. So welcome guys, great to see you and I uh, hope you enjoy what I'm showing you. Um, before we go any further, please hit the like and subscribe buttons and the little bell which will tell you when I'm putting out a new video. So as you can see I'm trying to get into the spring mode of wearing a lighter colour jacket for going out to a nice little party or something. Uh, more for a little bit warmer weather uh, somewhere between spring and summer. Um, so this last week I went out shopping. I was going to show you these last week but I picked up these trousers uh, from Marks and Spencers. Now you can see they've got a little bit of patination to them. Not a lot, which is exactly what I wanted. Um, 35 pounds, and I'll show you what they look like in a little bit. Very happy with those. Um, not a big Marks and Spencers uh, fan, but they keep popping up with the right things for me uh, more recently. Uh, I've also made a bad buy. Um, so I was looking around online and I saw this jacket come up and this is the picture. Uh, but in reality, um, I mean I really like the picture, but in reality uh, this is the actual product. Now, a bit difficult to see from this. Um, the advert states that it's fleece lined and things like that. Um, to be quite honest, if you can get any fleece in that, I mean, that'd be a miracle. It's just, there's nothing in it. It's thin, um, it's all fake, um, and it doesn't look that great, to be quite honest. Um, but the sending it back to uh, a different country like China um, costs a lot of money. So I made a complaint, got 20 pounds off. I'll maybe wear it occasionally. I'll show you what that looks like in a minute. So how have you been getting on? Uh, thank you again for the guys who sent in their outfit ideas last week and one of them has replied to me, uh, Mark that is, uh, who's now not going to wear his 44 jacket and he's going to get a 42 one. Great idea because it fitted him so much better. Um, it really is important that you get that shoulder tucked correctly and there's no overhang. You know you see lots of people on TV, I mean even um, even um, Top Gear, you know, they're quite old now, but you see Jeremy Clarkson, he's wearing this huge jacket, just oversailing at the top. Now, I know he's a big guy, but it doesn't fit, and it sticks out a mile. Have a look yourself. You'll, you'll see people about in the street or on some television programmes uh, of average people, that is, wearing clothes that are far too big for them. I know I keep banging on about it, but fit is king. Let's have a look at those trousers. All right, so here are the trousers that I um, wanted to show you. Um, they're such a nice colour, go very, very well with the black. Put black belt on, got my black shoes on, uh, as you can see. Um, they are a great fit, they're very comfortable, and they go well with black. Absolutely fantastic. So let's have a look at that jacket. So here it is, it won't necessarily go with what I'm wearing. Good fit, I must say. The, the leather is, I don't think it's leather. It sort of feels like it, but I, it's so thin, I, I really don't think it's leather. And this is so soft, it's, it's lovely. Uh, obviously it's not real um, but you know done up it's 
it's not bad. Tell me what you think, gents. Forty pounds from Kotosen, uh, which is the same name as another company, uh, and I'll talk about that a little bit more now. So uh, Kotosen is a, a Chinese company. Uh, takes a couple of weeks or so to to arrive, um, but the quality isn't great. But if you complain, they will give you twenty pound off, so it sort of reduces the price down quite a bit. Um, made a silly mistake there, really. Um, sending it back would have probably cost me over twenty pounds in um, in fees, and in the end, I decided to keep it as a very lightweight jacket in the summer that I can just toss over my arm, and maybe or maybe not wear. Perhaps you can tell me what you think. Uh, do you think it looks good? Does it look bad? Or should I just throw it away? So there we are for this week's video, gentlemen. Again, please hit the like and subscribe buttons, hit that little bell, and make a comment. I really want your comments. The more comments I get, it's easier for me to come up with things for you. Make some suggestions of what you guys want to see on 60 Over Fashion. Until next week, take care, have a great weekend. Bye bye.